Alrighty guys, for today's video, I am going to be showing you how to play Nefiri like a pro. He is officially releasing today, and this is the champion that Riot said will help people learn how to play assassins in general. Very straightforward, so let's just get right into it. You got your dogs, they help you do damage when you, you auto, and like you can see that right there. Next up we have our Q, two little skill shots you throw out, they go through minions, First one does damage, does a little bit of bleed, shoot your dogs at them for a few seconds. And then the next one, if you hit the first one, it does bonus damage. Oh, and look, our, our dog just CSs for us. Uh, w is a charged lunge, which we'll go over in a bit. E is a dash that does AoE damage. And then our ult gives you a bunch of movement speed and extra damage. Not like too crazy, honestly. And you can see right there, literally all we're doing in lane is just throwing Qs out. Nothing crazy at all. Uh, but yeah, we're going to go E second, just get some more damage. We're going to go ahead and just press Q. Oh man, and we have to be careful about not going into tower range while dogs are attacking, because that means that we will actually pull aggro, just like if you have a Sunfire Cape. Nice. So as you can see, literally all we're doing is just throwing Q after Q. Uh, e is if they get close to us, we're going to dash on top of them. And we've literally landed every Q doing so much damage. Keep autoing. I don't miss any minions either. So what I want to do now is actually consider using my W. We're actually not going to do that. We're just going to play a little bit slow. Good damage. I think we can actually go for a dive here. Nice. Okay, so right there, what we did was we used our Q, or our W rather. It's a charging dash, so you can pick a target and you start flying at them aggressively after like a second or two. And then after that, we just, you know... Throw our W out. Pretty simple stuff. You can also use it on objectives, or yeah, on uh, jungle and minions. So it can be used to escape stuff, jump over walls, I believe, etc, etc. It's just good stuff overall. Okay, so we're going to grab this. I will say, I mean, a lot of people, they don't think it counts. I, I think it kind of counts, considering it's, you know. Anyways, I got the first Nefiri Pentakill in existence uh, when it came out in the test realms in just like 20 minutes after it came out. Um, so, and I think my very first game we got like 40 kills and they had uh, two challenger players on the enemy team on that video. So I'd say we played it pretty well. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and just chill here. Last hit, but yeah. So our E actually has a uh, Passive. Packmates are recalled to Nefiri and restore 100% of their health. So when we use our E, it brings our doggies back to us. It's like right there, you can see they're next to us. Just in case you don't want your doggies to like take some damage. Alright, we got ignited. I think she panicked a little bit. But we're looking for small, ooh, short trades. Nothing too crazy. Let's see if we can get a cute. There we go. Pretty free. Just predicted her eating onto the uh, onto the bouncing blade. And. Nice, and our E has two different damage uh, hitboxes when we use it and when we land, just like Kane's Q. Except for the second part, when, where we land does, does way more damage. Almost double. And we can use our E to jump over walls. I think that's something that a lot of people didn't know. So like, it's a pretty decent size range, like range for a dash. So definitely. So good. 
jump over this just because we can. Why not? Uh, unfortunately, it looks like our uh, top lane, Orn, is uh, no longer with us. He's uh, gone on to the, the next world or something. I don't really know where he is, to be honest, but it is what it is. And if I can, I will definitely just go for a jump on him. Noon's on the way. I mean, we have nothing really to worry about. Nice, free kill. So let's talk about the ultimate. Our passive Hound's Pursuit gains 80 more range. Um, but on top of that, we activate our ult and it's kind of like Warwick's uh, Blood Send where enemies nearby, we get more movement speed towards them um, and a bit of extra damage. And you can kind of just read this. It's it's slightly complicated, but it's also incredibly simple at the same time, so. Oh my god, thank god. Thank god. Okay. That was uh, way too close. Okay. Yeah, activates the hunt, empowering our pack, giving us bonus damage, spawns two extra doggies, which actually do a lot of damage as well. Good damage. All right. There we go. Look at that bonus damage. So, uh, yeah. Actually, our uh, our ultimate gives us bonus range on our W. So we immediately pressed R plus W. And we just flew onto the Katarina from a mile away. There goes my reputation. What? Okay. I'm pretty sure I saw Singe Jungle heading over to me, but... I don't think it's worth dying over. We're just gonna head back. Yeah, I think Katarina's actually looking for me. I'm good. Thank you, though. I think I'll just head back really quick. And the question is do we got Yomu's or Duskblade? I think it's very clear that there are pros and cons to each item. Like, Yomu's is slightly better for roaming. And that initial burst, but Duskblade, you can't beat jumping in as a champion who has no escape. You all we get are are is engage. So to have that Night Stalker, or not Night Stalker, the um yeah, the untarget ability after we get a kill, that's you can't beat it, honestly, in my opinion. Doggies will just last it for us. Even though it's a 45, I have faith we can win this game. Now that's that's a lot of damage, I'm not gonna lie. I think uh, we just did about 70% uh, of our health in, uh, almost instantly. There we go, free kill. Now we can hunt her down with our dogs. Okay, she ease away like a dog. <laughs> nice, first turret is good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, I'm just saying, like, the dash range on our W is probably what makes this champion the most broken when you're fed. The early game damage is how you get fed in the first place. And then also the fact that your ult gives you, it's just so good for roaming. Okay, Orin's in my chat. Uh, apparently disconnected, internet went out. All good, bro. Okay, that's E over. Damn. 
I don't even need to use our Q to wave clear, man. That's crazy. Nice wave clear. And we're gonna look to poke. Yeah, so you can see the damage is uh, is there. <laughs> you can see uh, that the champion does a lot of damage. Now the question is, do my dogs tank the tower? They do. Look at all these dogs tanking the tower, man. And it counts as minions, actually. I don't know if that's a bug or not, but it seems like we were able to uh, pretty much not need our own minions to clear out the Slightly worried. Yeah, I mean, I don't care how fed you are from being 1v1 or 1v0 in the lane. Oh, we got the snipe off though. Predicted the Katarina E. Yeah, I have no clue where bot lane is. I don't have money for a tier. And I don't think it's a good idea either way, but. Blue buff is very nice on this champion. Let's just put it that way. 20 seconds. Okay, we can get it. That's west. Yep. All right, our blue will be up in 15. We're just going to go for that. It would have been probably smarter to roam down to bot lane, but I think to make up for it, we're going to go ahead and uh, pay a visit to uh, this guy right here. If you stay there, he is there. Anyways, have a good day, bro. All right. Yeah, the damage is insane. Oh, you know what? Actually, since it's a... We have our dogs. Let's just go ahead and um, take use of them. Since we have six dogs right now... Oh, never mind. They all died. I think we should just get the sh uh, some plates. I don't think we can get more plates, unfortunately, but... Maybe we get one more... Come on, let's go. Very last second. All right. And yeah, no need to rush out of the turret because uh, doggies will tank for you. Pretty standard combo W, close the gap, then Q, E, Q. Just save time, because you want to just use all your abilities as fast as possible. Oh, nice steal. Okay. We have our ult available. How many dogs do we have? Six? That's crazy. That's so funny. After we get a quadra, the game just like lets us know that you can FF. So we have an AFK player. Yeah, I think we're 1v5ing this. Oh, that's tough. Oh, he actually... Oh, that's unfortunate. Tarek did have ult up. Uh, that's okay. Kind of. Yeah, Aatrox just got a lot of gold. Oh, it wasn't up? Oh, never mind. Okay, but probably just came up. Never mind. All right. Um, It's all good. I think we're going to Edge of Night just to be a little bit safe against... No, I think we're gonna go collector. Collector and then We're looking at getting GA since we really are so squishy. 
it would be nice to just like we have a nice little lead so far so i'm just gonna keep that like secure Oh. Um. They aren't really committed to fighting that, but it's fine. All right, we go in. I was trying to dodge the uh, the the Terracle. Swap to Katarina. There we go. Oh my God! Wait, we can't get that. We can't get that. I mean, we can. Ah, I forgot we could actually just push the wave. I don't know what I'm doing. We're griefing a little bit. Not quite. Yeah, we. I don't know what we're doing, to be honest. Yeah, I'd love to not do that again. Because we should have just gone for uh, that. But that's okay. Uh, don't do it. Wait for us. If it's 4v5, we need to just play it like actually very smart. Okay, team, let's do it. Oh, man. Team, let's do it. No way, not the new new lagging too. Oh my god, we one shot with electrocute. Yeah, that'll never get old. I can uh, I can say that confidently. That part of this champion never gets old. Oh hey, new news back. I didn't know new new left. Well played. Yeesh. Ugh. <laughs> I think Derek went a little bit aggressive, I'm not gonna lie. But I, I was here for it, but it was also just a dumb idea. Let's get Grievous now. Grievous wounds will be so nice. Executioners. Yeah, we gotta just play uh, a bit smarter. Uh, it's all good. Let's get this dragon. We can win this. Aatrox is very big, but I got a Grievous, so that should really screw him over. Just get this really quick. Nice. That's tough. He's uh, split pushing in a 4v5. You hate to see it, honestly, but hey, whatever you can do to get a win, I suppose. Finish him off, team. The, ah, there we go. What the dog doing, man? Let's go. Okay. Keep it going. Keep it going, dog. Okay. Yeah, we create a pack mate every so often. Not quite up yet.
ult or something. Huh. Oh, he didn't have ult. Yeah, we didn't even get the inhib. That's actually so sad. Uh, Alright, let's get a chem tank. Dragons up. 23 kills. We just need to ace them. We need to go for Baron, I think. We actually have so much damage, even though Master has the like the worst build I've seen, I think. Unlucky, I guess. Alright, team, I believe in you. Alright, we got ult ready to go. Wait for Turk to come back up. Yeah, we can't be clearing out. I think it's better if Master Yi clears top instead of... Because he only has one kill. That's tough. Let's kill this guy now. Oh, he TP'd. Don't have any wards on Baron either. That's tough. Good poke. What are you doing, man? This guy is actually trolling. Okay. We need Nuna to engage. <laughs> Ouch. That's tough. We just, uh... Huh. Ah. Uh. What the... Ah, <laughs> uh, that's tough. Um, I'm gonna sell this. Yeah, not much we can do there. I mean, we could've won the fight, I think. We didn't... Hmm. Alright. Yeah, we have two teammates that are DC'd on our team. Um, let's... See, what can we do? What can we do? I think Grudge could be good, honestly. That should be really good here. They do have a bit of armor. Get that slow, it helps us destroy them. Nice. Nice. Mm. You know, considering it was a 4v5, ah, 3v5, let's be completely honest. Um, eh, 1v5. I think it was a really good game, I'm not gonna lie. I think if we had our top laner just like soak up damage, if nothing else, I think we would've won that game easily. Tch. 
Okay. Try to get this pretty easily. Oof. Okay, not bad, not bad. Yeah, I'm not really sure how we're gonna win through this though. Oh, what the heck? Where'd this guy come from? All right, collect them. Send them to the collector. Okay, we're officially max build. If we win this game, that would genuinely be amazing. I'd be so happy. But do I get home guards? Okay, there we go. More time for Master G to scale, right? Alright, so our E, the second part, does yeah, almost double the damage. Hmm. Considering swapping Paralysis for Edge of Night, but I think that'd honestly be a really good idea. I kind of want to find someone just caught out, like this guy. Go hit him with a little bit of a one-shot angle. Not going for it. I don't know where Aatrox is either. Damn. Um, yeah, let's sell. Let's sell Edge of Night. Or let's sell Prowls and get Edge of Night. Or, yeah, I think it's it's probably good to do. Or we could even just sell Boots and get it. I mean, we do have Relentless Hunter. That's a, I, I, it's, it's just a, you never know what the best move will be. It'll have to find out, right? Damn. Just run. Oh, oh crap, I really wonder if we needed two people clearing minions when one of them is a mastery, to be honest. And then he swapped his build completely. Honestly, for the best, his build was really stupid. Do you want to play the game? What even is this game? What a fiesta, this is so dumb. Oh man, not the minions. Okay. Honestly, I haven't seen Aatrox for a minute, so if he disconnected, that would be amazing. I'll just tell you that right now. If, there's a, if there are the League Gods, if they truly exist, he would disconnect too and make it fair.
Nice. My God, if we can win. That'd be insane. Okay, let's just keep dashing. Try to get that in hip quick. But like, where is anyone on my team though? Did they just spawn? Am I tripping? Like, where is everyone? I don't understand. Where are they? Like, what are you doing farming the jungle? Like, am I trick guys? Like in the chat, like, am I missing something? Did they just spawn? Or are they actually just farming jungle at 34 minutes into the game? Bad, not bad. It was just too late. Damn it. Oh, we literally would have killed everyone and maybe won the game there, but. It honestly, it was a really good attempt. It just wasn't meant to be, I suppose. Ah, that was still such a good game. I think if you guys had a slightly better than average AI bots, you would win your game. But thank you guys for watching and have a great day. Peace out.